Welcome to NordVPN Insider Updates. Here's everything you need to know about the NordVPN app and its products. In this episode, we will present the latest updates for Windows and Mac OS platforms. Join us for real-time insights and news from the people in charge. Hello again. As you may have noticed, some new destinations, like the Isle of Man, have been introduced as virtual locations in the NordVPN application. To make it easier to discern these options from all the others, we added a label virtual, which will be shown next to virtual locations in our app in all the places where you can make a connection. Regarding threat protection, we have continued streamlining our existing features to make them more useful to our users. To achieve this, we have updated all of the vulnerability descriptions that you can see in our app if a vulnerable app is found on your device. With this new update, it should be easier to determine what impact a vulnerability can have on your personal data, helping you to take preventative action sooner. Now, the vulnerability description wasn't the only thing to be clear in threat protection. Our file protection scan statuses were not perfect. For example, a downloaded photo would get a couldn't scan status just because the file type is safe and, by its nature, cannot host malware. To clarify, file protection will notify you only if the file is safe, scanning failed, malware, or double extension was detected. Hey there! I'm more than excited to present what kept us busy at night with the NordVPN macOS app. Besides the VPN, there are many other beneficial features, one of which is threat protection. Threat protection is available in the macOS Sideload app, which you can download from our web. The latest feature addition is the ability to temporarily pause the protection, either web protection, file protection, or both. If something is not working as expected while using the threat protection, or if you just need a break from it, no problem. Just hit the pause button in the main threat protection screen and pause web or file protection for five minutes, half an hour, or even two hours. The pause protection resumes automatically after the time you set, or you can resume it manually at any time. Our threat protection engineers keep improving and delivering to make your browsing experience a smooth sail. It's an ongoing process, so if you have to pause threat protection more often than not, don't hesitate to report a problem so we can act immediately on your feedback. While our Sideload app contains a fully featured threat protection, the App Store app version has its own simpler version. It blocks ads and harmful sites for safer browsing by filtering web content when you are connected to your VPN. Blocking ads and harmful sites is possible without the VPN connection. To do so, switch to the Sideload app version and enjoy fully featured threat protection. You can easily replace your App Store app by installing a Sideload app version available to download from our website. If you like this video, subscribe to our channel for more NordVPN updates and videos.